okay for you uh, 944 fanatics who uh, subscribe to uh, and read all the PCA tech uh, answers and questions. We run into the 944 tech expert, George Buslick, who's come down from up north to the warm Daytona heat, although it's starting to rain now. Uh, George, tell us a little about, bit about the, you know, where you come from, how far you've driven, and how many Daytona 24 hours is this for you? Uh, well, uh, hi, I'm George Buslink. I'm from Ulster Park, New York, which is up north of uh, New York City. Um, I drove uh, 1,600 miles to get here. It took me uh, about 18 hours. Um, I, I've been here since Monday, staying with a friend of mine uh, in New Orlando. And I've, uh, this is the 18th year I've come down here. The first year I came down was uh, when I first joined the Porsche Club in 1988. And uh, my wife and I uh, were worked the uh, the timing boards for Dyson and his 962s back then. So we've, it's it's a great place to be in the winter, certainly because it's uh, now four degrees at my home in uh, New York, and it's uh, oh, I'd say it's about 65 here right now. Even with the rain, it's really nice to be here. Great racing. The uh, hospitality tent that PCA puts up is just a wonderful thing. If you haven't come down for this, you really ought to come down. Uh, as far as uh, I don't know if uh, Vu has taken pictures of the corral. He probably has, but there there must be 150, 200 cars here, all Porsches, all in very nice condition. And of course, my favorite cars are the 944s, and it's nice to see them out, even though they're all 20-year-old cars now. So, that's great. It for me. We got a bunch of uh, 944s, 968s, 928s, uh, everything from a. Uh, I think the oldest is the 5356 to the latest GT3 2010 GT3 Cup car. Come on down, you can't miss it. Okay, we're here still at the uh, PCA Corral at the 24 Hours of Daytona. We're standing in front of a beautiful 2010 Cayenne GTS, brand new. Belongs to Porsche Melbourne, a premier Porsche dealer, three years in a row. We're here with Horst Seibert, who's the general manager, and Tom Gorsuch, the PCA membership chair for National. And we're going to talk a little bit about how the dealers have become integral parts of the success of PCA regions, and in particular, this corral at the 24 hours Daytona. Tom, uh, give us a little uh, insight into what the dealers have done for the uh, PCA corral. Well, the, uh, the dealers help sponsor a lot of uh, activities that go on here, uh, and food, and uh, goodies, and snacks, and uh, they also um, help pay for some of the, uh, the activities, such as the tents. And uh, they just have people here, you know, having a good time with us, and uh, so we enjoy having them. A horse came in, and we, we pulled him over because he was unloading drinks and snacks and whatnot uh, for all the fans and the PCA members. So he's not only the sales manager, but he's working hard uh, to make everyone comfortable here. Uh, how many years have you been coming, and uh, what do you think the dealership gets out of this uh, synergy between PCA and uh, the dealer? We've been doing this now three years in a row, and the weather so far has done well for us. And uh, the uh, the uh, relationship between the Porsche Club and the dealership is it we are growing relationships, and the the, the membership in our in our region we've been uh, exploding. And uh, I'm a little nervous, as you know. <laughs> um, and. Um, yeah, we we just we're here for the cu for the customer for uh, you know the friendship and it's not just about the car. So you're really an enthusiast as well as uh, part of the dealer and the success. And I know Porsche of Melbourne is probably the fa favorite one of the more favorite dealers here in the area, and we see it quite a lot. And you probably got one of the best jobs because you get to drive the GTS in and around Daytona this weekend. So I yeah. think everybody's going to be jealous. Yeah, I uh, I love Porsche and it's a passion of mine, and I can create this enthusiasm and people feel it you know so that's what Porsche is all about I've been doing this in, since 95 and my first Porsche I've ever sold was a 993 turbo so once you start there you can't go anywhere else well that's great so there you go the Porsche dealers even get involved to make this a uh, great weekend and a great experience for PCA members